Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and today all four of the brand new 2021 Lego Marvel Eternal sets were just revealed by a Canadian Lego catalog. Thank you to that. These pictures are all over Instagram and they look amazing. These four sets are some of the best I've seen in a very long time with 10 excellent minifigures spread across all of them and honestly i can't say i just want to show you guys the pictures because these sets are amazing i'm so excited for them and this movie up first we have 76145 the eternals aerial assault for $13.99 with 133 pieces and two minifigures we have sprite and icarus icarus not sure how to say that not sure why sprite is doubled as like a ghost there but i mean it's pretty interesting uh the both of those characters look great with some really cool printing. And then we also get a Deviant build. These guys are in every single set, and they look interesting. They remind me a lot, not so much this one, but definitely the later ones, of those Hero Factory monsters from a while ago. And this one is really cool. I'm not sure if this is a Canadian price or an American price. If it's um, Canadian, I'm assuming it's going to be $10 for America, but i got no idea. Uh, it's a really cool-looking set. Definitely the only way to get Sprite, uh, so that's pretty much what people are going to buy it for, but it's still a pretty cool one. Next, we have set number 76154, uh, the Deviant Ambush for uh, what I believe 1999. Uh, the number got cut off there with 197 pieces and three minifigures. Here we got Gilgamesh, who is exclusive to this set and has some really cool looking gauntlet pieces and amazing gold designs. I, oh, that character looks amazing. We also have Thena, who looks like some really cool printing with the Ninjago staff from the Ice Wave. Pretty cool. We also have... Ma Malkari, Malkari, uh, she's got a brand new hairpiece. Her clothes look a little bit like Sif's, and I love the design there with that, with that gray and maroon. Looks really, really cool. And then this Deviant especially reminds me of those Hero Factory monsters. I love the look of it. I have no idea what the Deviants are, but there's some really cool stickers and pieces there. Very excited for that set. Uh, the third set is 76155 for $79.99, uh, 693 pieces, four figures. This is in Arshim Shadow. I'm assuming this is the Celestial Arshim. We've seen this guy in clips from Guardians of the Galaxy before. Looks amazing. We have Ajak, uh, who I believe is exclusive to this set. We have Kingo, also exclusive to this set. And then I Icarus again. And then Cersei, who comes in one more set. Also a small deviant, uh, reminiscent of that $10 one. Uh, you can see that in the side picture there. The minifigures here look amazing. I'm especially interested in I I Ajak. Uh, she looks really cool with some great printing. And Kingo in purple there looks really, really cool. Um, the, the build itself is amazing. I love the celestial design. It's like a giant, like, Iron Giant style monster. I love it. I can't wait to find out more about these guys because they've been all over the MCU. And the final set is 76156, the Rise of the Domo with uh, 100, uh, $119.99, 1,040 pieces, six figures. Here we have Icarus again for the third time, Thena for a second time, Cersei for a second time. And then Druug and Fasfos exclusive to this set. And then Markarai again. This has two Deviants. I love the one that looks like a Ben 10 monster in the corner there. The other one is very reminiscent of the 1999 set. And then, wow, just this triangle shit is so cool. Something, it looks like straight out of Guardians. I've never seen a design like that before. Uh, and it opens up and it looks like you can fit all the Eternals inside. I'm not sure if this is... It says, with the Eternals spaceship, so it is the Eternals uh, spaceship, you can put all of the characters in there. It looks like they're all going to fit. I do love if you get six figures here, almost the entire uh, selection, because there's only ten. I love these sets. They look so cool. That brings us to uh, my thoughts overall. Amazing. I can't wait to get all four of these, get all these characters together. I do like how the characters feel very evenly spread out. I think um, Icarus is the main character in this because he appears three times. A bunch of other characters appear only once and then a couple two times. I think it's a good spread. You definitely get enough of each character. Although I would have loved another Gilgamesh because that character just looks like my favorite. I also recognize him from outside of the uh, MCU. The uh, Deviant Monsters, you get four, five of them overall, excuse me. They look really cool. I'm excited to stack them up, maybe make one giant Deviant or something. I love how we're getting a Celestial on Lego. Um, the scale is definitely off because uh, the Nowhere Escape Mission set from, was that 2004? 15 uh, should be fitting inside that guy's head if i'm not mistaken so that's a little awkward but these sets overall look amazing i'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments down below i'm super super excited and then oh my bad i just looked up top it's actually the uh deviant ambush is 29.99 not 19 
Ooh, that is a that is a lot. Thirty dollars for a two hundred piece set. Okay, I hope that that one's a little overpriced. But uh, otherwise, I'm definitely gonna get all these and put reviews out. Comment down below which character is your favorite, what you think of this movie so far, and which set is your favorite. Because I'd love to hear from you. That's all I got for today, though. I'm so happy we finally got pictures for these. I have no idea when they're gonna release. I'm assuming march because i doubt they're releasing in like three days we definitely would have heard of them before that they would have leaked somewhere but these are amazing that's all i got today though guys thank you so so much for watching i'll see you all in the very next video there should be another news video coming out in maybe about an hour so stay tuned for that and i want you all to have a fantastic and safe rest of your day